Welcome to webbikeworld.com. This time we're taking a quick look at the Aero Aviator off-road helmet. For the full review, more photos, and all the details, please visit webbikeworld.com. The Italian motorcycle helmet company Aero can always be counted on for unique and interesting designs, but they also make a very popular line of off-road helmets. The Aero Aviator is the company's top-of-the-line helmet in this category, and it's also claimed to be the lightest weight off-road helmet in the world with its hand-laid multi-axial carbon fiber and Kevlar shell that comes in an amazing three shell sizes for the range. We'd go farther than that even. The Aero Aviator is the lightest motorcycle helmet we've ever reviewed by far, and about 200 helmets have passed over the webbikeworld.com scales. How light is it? This Aero really does feel like it's made of air, so be sure to read the full webbikeworld.com review for all the details. This version is the ultra rare Monster Energy Drink graphics, and it was sold out faster than you can guzzle a can of the stuff. But the Aviator comes in a huge variety of other colors, race replicas like the Tony Caroli 222, many other cool graphics, and yes, even solid colors. As soon as you pick up the Aviator, you'll know something is different. It feels like it's filled with helium, honest. This one has an outstanding finish with a super shine and no flaws anywhere. It has a big removable and washable dust filter in the chin guard, along with two screen vents along either side. The chin vent, side vents, top vents, and eye port are all surrounded by nicely contrasting black ABS or hard rubber parts, and the cut lines are very tight, giving the helmet a very nice ambiance. The peak is innovative. It attaches with three screw-in studs that have a spring-loaded fold-over latch. It can be adjusted up and down, and the aviator comes with a separate peak tip, so the peak can be adjusted for different lengths. Two huge top vents are covered by large screens, and the aviator also comes with smoked plastic vent covers for the top to limit the airflow or to protect against the rain. There's plenty of extractor surface area in the rear of the helmet. It has a narrow spoiler with an exhaust port along the top, and a series of large exhaust extractors are built into the bottom of the helmet shell. The lower rear section of the helmet has another large spoiler that helps direct both the internal and external airflow. Everything has been optimized for light weight on the aviator. The D-rings are made of aluminum and the chin strap is attached to a separate snap along the top. They thought of everything. Even the chin strap padding can be removed if necessary. The liner material is very comfortable and the padding is fully removable and washable and the helmet has emergency cheek pad release tabs. The carbon fiber Kevlar helmet shell is amazingly stiff and it feels very sturdy, which seems almost impossible considering the light weight of this helmet, but somehow they did it. So that's a quick look at just a few of the features of the very cool, literally and figuratively, Arrow Aviator Motorcycle Helmet. For the full review, more photos, and all the details, please visit webbikeworld.com. Thanks for watching.